Hey everyone, this is this Junkie. Um, I know it's been a while, and uh, for anyone who's paying attention to my website, uh, I, you might have read or, yeah, whatever. Um, I haven't really set up a good place to do my video reviews yet. I'm still working on the DVD room. I uh, want to get some furniture in there and, you know, all that kind of stuff. So, um, um, I know there's been a lot of requests uh, that I haven't gotten around to uh, film. Um, but I hope to, you know, I got some time on my hands, so I hope I'll be able to shoot a lot of the requested videos, you know, later on. Um, for today, I did want to show you something that I got in the mail just a few days ago. Uh, one of the few DVDs I bought recently. And this was something I got on eBay. Uh, eBay Australia, actually. Um, it's, a, it's a film I really, really enjoy. Um, and it's sort of a cult classic horror film uh, that came out. Uh, not too long ago, uh, a few years, I can't recall. Uh, but anyway, it's uh, Wolf Creek, which is right here. Uh, and for anyone who looks at this edition and feels like, what the fuck is that? Uh, I can understand that. Uh, I was actually looking for a 4 disc limited edition, uh, which was released uh, as a store exclusive, an Australian store called JB Hi-Fi, I think, uh, who had a 4 disc limited edition uh, numbered, uh, and that was the one that I wanted to get, but while looking for that I came across this, uh, which I had never seen, and it's, you can notice it's an odd red cover, uh, and it's got like a gold writing, the logo is done in gold, it's hard to tell her, but it, but it is. Um, and I had no idea what the hell this was, I'd never seen this edition, so I was hoping that it was, you know, maybe a store exclusive, uh, or a first pressing, I mean, I didn't know. Um, but I figured, you know, didn't I couldn't find any info on it, so I just, I just bid for it, and I won it. And uh, I thought it was a fairly good price, so I you know, was happy to get it. But however, uh, when I got it home, uh, I could examine it more closely. I'm not sure if you can see that, but at the top there, it says in sort of like black writing, uh, it says Classic Australian Collection. Okay, so that was a clue, sort of like understanding and tracking down where this came from. Uh, and as it turns out, this is actually, uh, it's a single disc release, and this is part of a larger box set uh, called Classic Australian Collection, and I think it's volume 2, they've done like a couple of box sets, part of this collection, and this is part of the volume 2 box set, and it features like classic Australian cinema and cult movies and such, like Mad Max and Jim Devine and you know several other titles uh, but I didn't know that this was part of a box set when I bought it and I bought this alone so you know I don't uh, I don't have anything else for it uh, which was you know I got you know I was a bit disappointed realizing where this came from because I hate buying parts of sets especially by accident I mean now it feels like okay this is a nice digi pack. It actually is a digi pack. Uh, I didn't tell you, but single disc digi. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Um, at its front, the back, which is also, it's not, uh, it's red, but it's slightly tinted, uh, or you know, it's darker down here. That's not just a, a camera error, it actually is darker. As you know, notice that the background is slightly, it has got some slight graphics there. Um, uh, but you know, so, yeah. I'm not gonna send this back, because it's too much trouble. Um, but I will say that 
considering that it's part of a box set and I checked what the box set it's like a 10 disc box with 10 discs 10 movies uh, and checking what that costs and then in comparison to what I paid for this single disc from that box set I think I slightly overpaid and I didn't know it was part of a box set so it kind of pissed me off because now I don't know what to do with it you know sure it's nice diggy but you don't want just a set a diggy that was pulled out of the box set you want the complete set and the stuff just you know rubs me the wrong way I'm real purist that way uh, but I still thought I could show you this just for fun um, you notice that the spine it all the sets all the diggies in this box set uh, has the same style like the red cover like the silhouette different font for the logo and they got like the golden spine here it says like Wolf Creek and yeah and I'm gonna show you the inside too uh, it's a single disc diggy as I mentioned and the inside is sort of pretty plain it doesn't really stand out you know just pretty typical stuff and the disc art is not the same as on the uh, what can I say on the other Australian editions so this is an exclusive disc to that box set uh, but it's not particularly special you know it's the movie and it's got like uh, a commentary and like a yeah, I think that's it actually, commentary. Uh, but the digi pack, there's a uh, behind the disc there, just plain. So, <sighs> yeah, I'm not really happy about this purchase. It was a bit too costly, and seeing as it's one of the few things that I bought recently because I don't have a lot of money, you know. So, yeah, kind of a downer, but still, I really like the diggy. So, it's a sh I think I would have felt better not knowing actually, but. What are you gonna do? Um, so yeah, so uh, this was just to show you something at least. Uh, I know there's a lot of people probably waiting to see more videos, see me review more stuff, and you know. But I'm doing this for now, and you know until I get my, uh, you know, like shooting round or whatever like a good place to, to shoot my video reviews. Once I get that done, I will obviously shoot more frequently. But for now, I'm just showing you this as a little bonus because I'm not gonna put this up on the website as it's not a complete set. It's just, it's just crappy part of a set and I don't want to like put it up as, you know, like, yeah. It, it, I, I don't, I'm not putting it on the site just because it's part of a set. That's the only reason. But I thought it would be fun to show you, and I will put a link on the side there uh, in case you like uh, want to want to see where you can buy the box set, where this is where this came from or something. So yeah, uh, that's that about that. Surprisingly long video with me talking about absolutely nothing, and. Anyway, I just wanted to say that it feels good to be somewhat back. And I've trimmed my hair, as you can notice. Feels a whole lot better than, you know, all the beard and like crazy Wolverine type style that I had in my last video. Don't like that at all when, it's, when it grows out of proportion like that. So, yeah. See you all next time and, you know, sorry if everything's taking so long right now. Peace out. Bye bye.